Hi everyone, this is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. In this video, we are going to check out this new TTS model called as Spark TTS. This model enables zero-shot voice cloning and does it in quite an efficient and flexible way. As you can see, the size of model is just 0.5 billion and yet it produces highly accurate and natural sounding voice synthesis. This model is designed to be quite powerful both for research and production use. Before we get it installed locally and then play around with it, let me give you a bit more information on its architecture. And for that, I'm just going to take you to this paper, which you can also read through from this model card. And I will drop the link to it in video's description. If you look at this diagram, this shows you a quick overview of this model. So Spark TTS enables zero shot voice cloning from reference audio while also generating new speakers through coarse or fine grained attribute control. The final waveform is directly reconstructed from the predicted speech tokens using the bi-codec decoder. And the most important and intriguing thing for me is that this model comes from Quent 2.5 which is one of my favorite model when it comes to the text generation due to its quality. This has been built entirely on Coin 2.5 and it eliminates the need for additional generation models like flow matching. So instead of relying on separate models to generate acoustic features, it directly reconstructs audio from the code predicted by the LLM. This approach streamlines the process, improving efficiency and also reduces the complexity. Other than that, it supports zero-shot voice cloning, which means it can replicate a speaker's voice even without specifying training data for that voice. So if you want to do cross-lingual and code switching scenarios, you can easily do that with this model. It also supports both English and Chinese, so it is bilingual. And you can also create virtual speakers by adjusting parameters such as gender, pitch, and speaking rate. So let's try to get it installed locally and then we will see how it works. Let me also give a huge shout out to Mast Compute who are sponsoring the VM and GPU for this video. If you're looking to rent a GPU on very, very affordable prices, you can find the link to their website in video's description. Plus, I'm also going to give you a discount coupon of 50% for range of GPUs. So this is my Ubuntu system and this is my GPU card NVIDIA RTX S6000 with 48 GPU of VRAM. Let's start by creating a virtual environment with Conda and it is recommended to use Python 3.12 with it. And that is why I'm using it. Next up, let's git clone the repo of this Spark audio. And as I said, I'm going to drop the link to it in video's description. And then from the root of the repo, let's install all the prerequisites, which is going to take a couple of minutes. So let's wait. Meanwhile, let me also introduce you to the sponsors of the video who are Camel AI. Camel is an open source community focused on building multi-agent infrastructures for finding the scaling laws of agents with applications in data generation, task automation and world simulation. Okay, let's go back to see what is happening in our terminal. Almost there. Okay, everything is installed. Let's now log into Hugging Face because we need to download the model for that i'm just using hugging face cli and then i have already grabbed my read token you can also grab it from huggingface.co from your profile it's a free token and then i am logged in and in order to download this model i'm just going to go to my python interpreter like this and then let's get the function for downloading the model and then in order to download the model all you need to do is to run this snapshot download command and all i'm doing i'm just putting it in the local pre-trained models directory in the current repo and the model is being downloaded it's not a huge model as you can see so let's wait and the model is downloaded let's exit from here okay so let's now run the gradio demo so all i need to do i'm going to do is to run this command python web ui dot py it is going to launch the demo on my local system and there you go so the gradio demo is running let me go to my local host at port 7860 
and there you go so our spark tts is running let's do the voice cloning first so what i'm going to do i'm just going to select one of my own audio voice as a prompt and then i want it to say it in this life is long and pass it slowly take your time to do whatever you are doing so first let me play the original audio which i have uploaded what is happiness and then the text is as you can read life is long and pass it slowly and whatever so let's generate it and i will show it to you in real time to see how it goes so it is working let's also check vram consumption so consuming just close to 5 gig of vram 4.8 bit high i would say for a 0.5 billion model life is long and passes slowly take your time to do whatever you are doing no i don't think so that is my voice let's try out another one so i will maybe just go with a woman's voice let me play it first then leaving the corpse within the house they go themselves to and fro about the city and beat themselves with their garments bound up by a girdle okay let's generate it let's wait for it life is long and passes slowly take your time to do whatever you are doing yeah this one is much much better maybe because the quality of my previous audio was not good enough and maybe the sampling rate is lower than 16 kilohertz as they are suggesting here okay maybe i will just select any other audio to see how it goes <clears throat> sorry now it says chinese mm, let me first go with one of my own audio to see if i could give it another one i'll just go with this one solve this math equation x plus y is equal to x minus y okay so let's generate it and it has done it so let me play it life is long and passes slowly Take your time to do whatever you are doing. Nah, I don't think so. It is doing it properly. Maybe let's select another male voice. Maybe my audio is not good enough. Maybe I will. <clears throat> sorry, I'll just go with this one. This is Fad Mirza. Please subscribe to the channel. Okay. Let's try out this one. Life is is long and passes slowly take your time to do whatever you are doing yeah so this one is quite good i would say so it means that my audio previous audio is not good enough so this one is good okay let's try out a chinese one so for chinese i'm just going to select this voice and then for chinese text i'm going to give it a chinese text which is a simple translation of the same sentence so let's let me play the chinese one first original 院子门口不远处就是一个地铁站，这是一个美丽而神奇的景象。树上长满了又大又甜的桃子，海豚和金鱼的表演是很好看的。Okay, let's try to generate it. It's very, very quick. I mean, that is really uh, good stuff. 生命很长，过得很慢。花点时间做你正在做的任何事情 So the voice is definitely cloned, no doubt about that. So if your voice uh, audio sample is good, it will do the cloning quite nicely as we just saw. Okay, and then let's see how the voice creation works. I, to be honest, I haven't really tested it yet. So I'm just going to give it the same input text. Let's generate the male one. Maybe I will just keep it as is for now. Let's create the voice with the default settings. And then we can just tinker with these pitch and speed. It's long and passes slowly. Take your time to do whatever you are doing. It is also just doing some sort of, I would say, emotion in it. Okay, let's do, let's 
increase the pitch let's decrease the speed let's generate again it's almost there life is long and passes slowly take your time to do whatever you are doing well that's more guttural i would say so that is pretty interesting let's try out a female one okay should be fun let's try it out so it's a female voice let's create the voice on this text and we can play around with it definitely so just under a 10 second it creates a new voice just over hey hey don't just sit and listen to me hit that like button and subscribe to this channel and share it among your network you see you guys don't listen to me at least listen to her okay let me change the maybe i'll just change the pitch here i'll just increase speed little bit let's get it again 